What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough. Okay, so you saw in the beginning of this uh, episode that yes, I encountered a very, very special Pokemon, Absol. And if you guys remember, yes, I do have a bucket list, and uh, <laughs> we're returning back to the bucket list because, you know something... I've been wanting this Pokemon for a very, very, very long time. So, who did I replace this time around? Well, I replaced the man that actually helped me get this Pokemon, Raiden. And just to honor him, I named this Pokemon Noob Cybot. Now, that's a bit, like I put it all together because it, there wasn't enough space. So, yes, Absol the Noob Cybot from Mortal Kombat. I'm still honoring them because you know I'm still such a big Mortal Kombat fan. Yeah, Absol right here, level 30, yes I did train him off screen and I did teach him a new move, that way, you know, we, we start kicking some butt here for the, the, the gym right here. As you can see, its ability is pressure, it raises his foe's PP usage, lonely nature, level 25, route 120, it's a dark type Pokemon, of course, I gave it the experience share, it's, you know, it's a tough Pokemon to actually train right here. As you can see, its physical attack is much more, um, well, it's, it's big. It's pretty good right here. It's defense, not that great. Very speedy Pokemon. And the move that I taught him was Thunderbolt, if you guys don't remember. Back in New Mauville, once I fixed up the whole thing at New Mauville, we got Thunderbolt from Watson. And that's why I saved Thunderbolt specifically for this Pokemon right here. And the, the great thing about Absol is that it has such a big move pool right here. It can learn just about any kind of elemental move, and uh, I guess it's I guess the it's pretty much the jack of all trades for Pokemon right here. So there you have it, Noob Cybot, our little uh, our little Absol right here. And uh, well, I guess it's finally uh, finally time to actually go and take on the the Fortree City Gym. Now, if you remember in the last episode, we had to deal with a few Kecleons, you know, blocking along the way. Thanks to Steven giving us a Devon scope, we were actually to, you know able to find these guys and scare them off. So yeah, whatever. So here we go, Fortree City Gym. The leader is Winona, the bird user taking flight into the world, which is cool, awesome, great, gravy. Here we go, into the gym. And here's the guy, that, the only guy that's ever believed in us. He's like, yo, how is it going, Champion Bound Draven? Fortree Gym, uh, Fortree Gym leader Winona is a master of flying type Pokemon. She's waiting at the back of this gym behind the rotating doors. She's waiting for new challengers who are trying to take wing. Okay, go for it. You gotta love the puns. You really do. Now, as you can see, we have rotating doors right here. And uh, they're not that tough to actually go around. It's just you have to, you, you literally have to figure out which way to go. And I'm not gonna go down right here because you, sometimes you can trap yourself. Now, Actually, I'm going to start off with Noob Cybot right here because it does have Thunderbolt. And I just want to test them out. So here we go. When Winona takes a battle, or takes to battle, her face shines with beautiful determination. Let's see. I'm not like, I'm not letting you witness that lovely sight. Turns out this guy has a little bit of a crush. Or, okay, that's cool. He has a little bit of a crush with her. So here we go. Birdkeeper Humberto. Uh, Coming out with his Skarmory, holy crud, oh crud, okay, so they got a Skyblade themselves, and I got myself Noob Sabot. And, uh, oh crud, Skarmory, fast, very, very fast, so here we go, Thunderbolt attack, will it work? It does, look at that. And, uh, I'm gonna try and not waste this whole Thunderbolt thing, because I only have like 15 PP for this one. So there we go, Thunderbolt attack, again, eat it Skarmory, that's right, and Noob Sabot getting experience points up the you know what Urgh, I couldn't stop you you think you think alrighty now I'm, I know some of you guys are gonna be like you guys are gonna be asking why why didn't you save uh, or why didn't you just let main nitric take this uh this battle right here why it's an electric type Pokemon why couldn't you just let him well Noob Saibot man I, I love this Pokemon if I had to choose between Noob Saibot and uh, and Raiden Literally in Pokemon right here. I would choose Noob Saibot because it's one of my favorite Pokemon. Now, we got a, we got a double battle right here. So I'm going to go with Gaia and Swamp Lord right now. And uh, we're going to be battling these two guys right here. Because I like, behold the elegant battle style of bird Pokemon. Winona taught me personally, you can't beat me easily. Okay. Bring it. Just bring it. Like The Rock says it. Just bring it, Jabroni. So there we go, Bird Keeper Jared and Picnicker Ashley wants the battle, and they're coming out with both Swablu and Doduo. Alrighty, let's go. Bring it on. Look at that, looking like beasts from the Middle East. 
if not the east, or some kind of eastern side. I don't know. Both sides are pretty cool. Here we go, surf attack. That's right. There goes Doduo, getting hit like a rock, and uh, Swablu survives somehow. Noob Saibot getting experience points because, you know, it's Noob Saibot. And, uh, well, there's a Skarmory. And uh, Psychic Attack will just uh, take care of that. But it's not that effective against a Skarmory right here. Oh, God. All right, so we're going to go with this one. And we're going to go with that one. And if you don't like it, here we go with that one with the Surf Attack. Say goodbye to Skarmory again. And say goodbye to Swablu again. Look at that. That's right, Swamp Lord kicking butt right now, and Noob Cybot grows to level 31, and it's learning Double Team. Huh, what kind of moves should I take out? Actually, it does have a good move set right now. I don't wanna, don't wanna mess with that. So we're not gonna learn Double Team right now. And uh, alrighty, Noob Cybot getting experience points because it does have the experience share. And here comes out. Well, here comes Tropius. Believe it or not, like I was amazed. I was so amazed by this, but I, yeah, Tropius is a flying type Pokemon. How does it fly? You see those big old leaves on its back? Yeah, it flies just like that. I'm still, I'm still wondering how does a giraffe fly? I want to know. And this chick has nothing but Swablus. I really okay. So we're gonna go with that. And uh, I don't know. Let's go with Secret Power on that guy. So Secret Power. That was probably Body Slam or something or Strength. I don't even know. Eat it, eat it, eat it. All right, Gaia, do your thing. Destroy Tropius. Didn't destroy Tropius, and oh, here comes that Razor Leaf attack, and it hits both of us. And uh, that is a little, oh well, yeah, that's super effective, but it does not, it, it does not phase me at all. Not at all. Say goodbye to Tropius. And uh, look at that, new Cybot growing levels like crazy. He's like, you're, you're strong. I was beaten. That's right, you were beaten. Not physically, but you were beaten in Pokemon, so eat it. Alrighty, so let's see. We're gonna go right here. We're gonna go right here. And I messed up. Oh, no, never mind. I didn't mess up. I didn't screw up. Okay, so let's go ahead and try and pick out some new Pokemon right here. Let's go with Raphael and new Shybot. Now, Shroom Lee can't do anything right now because it's Shroom Lee. And you know what? That gives me a great idea. You know, a little bit of a, a tribute. So, I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, so, it just reminded me, there's one Pokemon on my team that I really can't use in this gym because it has a double uh, flaw. So, for good old time's sake, yes, guys, I brought back the man, the myth, the legend, Raiden. So, we're going to battle with Raiden right here and, uh, you know, set him on a farewell until we see him again and somehow. And we're not really retiring him, but we're going to use both our Pokemon right here. So, bring it on for the double battle. There's no need for Winona, our gym leader, to deal with you. I'm plenty good enough for you. The lovers of bird Pokemon aspire to join this gym. As a member of the Fortree Gym, I am not allowed to lose. Alrighty, bring it on. You're about to beat the deadliest uh, alliance. That's right. I said that. Deadly Alliance. That's right. The Deadly Alliance of uh, Raiden and Noob Saibot. That's right. I'm bringing back Noob Saibot and Raiden. So we're going to go with this right here. And we're going to go with that right there. So we're going to see how you guys do right here. So here we go. Shockwave attack. For the win. Suck it, Doduo. Suck it. You guys have no chance whatsoever. No chance in hell. That's right. I'm actually quoting uh, Vince McMahon's theme song right there. And here we go, the wing attack. How is that faster than my Pokemon? Again, Noob Saibot has a pretty weak defense, but you know what? It can learn that Thunderbolt attack, and uh, look at that. Nearly defeats that Swellow. So we're going to go Shockwave on you, and we're going to go Thunderbolt on you. So here we go, Shockwave for the win. Raiden showing Noob Saibot the ropes. He's like, take a look at this, rookie. That's how you do it. Destroying you. Finishing you. And uh, coming out with the Zatu. Alrighty, so we got we, 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 we can do this. We can win. And here we go. Quadruple the damage on you because you're both flying and water type. And there goes uh, Pelipiper. I'm just playing Pelipper. Pelipiper first. And uh, look at that. Noob Saibot grows level 32. Very good on uh, experience, I guess. And uh, we're going to just destroy the crud out of this whole Pokemon right here. Zatu, it's been nice. 
Bye bye. You see, Raiden's just showing the ropes. He's like, Noob Saibot, this is how you do it. That's right. You didn't like that? Eat it. So we beat Eduardo and uh, that other dude. And he's like, What? Well, I, I lost! He's like, It was too much of a load for me to bear. Pretty much was. You, you guys suck. Okay, so moving on forward, I think we got, yeah, we got one more Pokemon right here. I would, I would love to do a double battle, I guess. Eh, what the hell, let's do this. Bring it! You better know. You better know that there are all sorts of flying type Pokemon. You do know that, right? No, not really. I mean, I only have a Charizard and, you know, a few other flying type Pokemon like Toxabat, man, you know, that kind of stuff. So there we go, Darius is coming out, and he's coming out with his Tropius. Now, this is a problem right here because Raiden is, a, is only an electric type Pokemon. So I'm going to use that return attack. Look at that. Beat the crud out of Tropius. Nothing. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. Okay, so we can't do this. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, so that's a lot of uh, points right there. So we're going to go to the man right here, Raphael. He was built for this. Defense and all. He's like, alrighty. Another victim. So Tropius going with that Razor Leaf. And here we go. Flamethrower. Until, well, we get one more hit right here. Just one more. And, uh, alrighty. Let's go. Flamethrower attack. Eat it. No more Tropius. Look at that. Look at that. Easy. Easy bake. Easy bake. Just like that. And Raiden grows to level 34. Okay, alright. Noob Shab on everything. Raphael, you know, all that stuff. You know, these Pokemon are doing so great. You see, I have a bucket list for a reason, guys. Because I, like I said, I'm going to be using different types of Pokemon. And, you know, it is, it, you know, they all have a reason. It all has a purpose, I should say. Now, this part right here, you're going to have to get it down. I mean, okay, hold on. You, you're going to have to get the whole alignment down just so you can uh, actually move through this whole area right here. And uh, I screwed up. Did I screw up? Hold on. Could we? No, I did screw up. Okay, so we should have done, uh, let's see, we should have done this. Put this up right here. Crap. Okay, so as you can see, this, like all of these have its uh, has its little ins and outs right now so we're gonna have to go right here here and uh, down here bringing it back down and uh, there you go believe it or not that was not that hard okay so here's Winona the beautiful flying type gym leader and uh, yeah she's wait she's been waiting for us for quite some time so what we're gonna do right now is uh, actually heal up our Pokemon right here so I did stock up on hyper potion so give that to Raiden and uh, I'm gonna give that to Noob Sabot. And one and more, one more. Not that guy right again. I'm gonna go with uh, Raphael right here. That's right. Okay. Alrighty. Let's do this. I am Winona. I am the leader of the Four Tree Pokemon Gym. I have become one with bird Pokemon and have soared the skies. However, grueling the battle, we have uh, triumphed over Grace, or with Grace. Witness the elegant choreography of bird Pokemon and I. Alrighty. Here we go, guys. Battle number six, our gym, le uh, gym leader number six, and it's Winona right here. Mm-hmm. Coming out with her Swablu. And I'm coming out with Raiden first. Okay, moving on forward right here, guys. As you can see, in Pokemon Ruby and Zapphire, she does have four Pokemon. And they're all in their level 30s right here now. She starts off with the Swellow, Pelipper, Skarmory, and Altaria. Now... Best Pokemon to defeat these guys, rock types, and uh, electric type Pokemon. For Altaria, if you want to beat them with, you know, a rock type, that's great. But it will it will try and evade that with an earthquake attack because rock type Pokemon, yeah, they are weak against that. So go ahead and try and find a nice type Pokemon if there is a nice type Pokemon available around that time. Now, moving on to the next one here. In Pokemon Emerald, she does have five Pokemon. And, uh... <laughs> As you can see, she starts off with her Swallow Blue, then comes out with uh, Tropius right here, then Pelipper, and Skarmory, and then Altaria. Like I said before, Altaria is a Dragon-type Pokemon, so the best chance to beat it is with a with an Ice-type Pokemon, uh, knowing that it does have Earthquake just to evade that. Now, Skarmory, we all know, you can beat it with a Fire-type Pokemon, as well as Tropius. So, you guys have a different... Uh, you you guys can find different ways to actually defeat these Pokemon right here. So now moving on forward, let's do this. Spark Attack for the win. Raiden winning this whole gym battle for us right here. As you can see, 
destroy Swablu. Eat it, Swablu. You nothing. New Cybok gaining experience, and she's gonna come out with her strongest Pokemon. So what I'm gonna try and do is I'm gonna evade it with Swamp Lord, since it is my strongest Pokemon. That's right, Swamp Lord right here. I'm gonna try and evade you. So here we go, Altaria. It is a Dragon type Pokemon. Now remember, it does have Dragon Breath, Dragon Dance as well, which increases its uh, strength by a lot. So just be aware of that, guys. If you let it increase its strength and speed every single time, it will beat you with just one hit afterwards. And as you can see, it's using that Dragon Dance. It's going to start messing with you right now. And uh, Dragon Breath, of course, will try and paralyze you. So be aware of that there. Yeah. So let's go again with another... Oh, crud. There's that Earthquake attack. Very powerful attack right there. And uh, here we go with a takedown. I'm going to go all physical on this Altaria's butt. And as you can see, critical hit. Eat it, Altaria. Eat it. That's right. Noob Cybot. Not doing anything. Just chilling like that. Chilling like the villain it is. And, uh, well, let's go with Raphael right here. We have the Pokemon to defeat her. So here we go, Raphael. The Torkoal. The guy. That's right, with the defense. The guy with the flamethrower right here. Look at that. It's faster than Tropius. Wow, it's, we found a Pokemon that's faster. And uh, would you look at that, Tropius. You, you've you been defeated. Quickly. Easily. No more bananas for you, homeboy. And uh, Noob Cybot grows to level 33. Wow. And she, she's coming out with her Pelipper. So let's go ahead and use Noob Cybot right here. Noob Cybot wins. Of course, Noob Cybot's one of my favorite characters in Mortal Kombat. Very mysterious. First, you know, Sub-Zero and all that stuff. Very good storyline. Here we go. Thunderbolt and, uh, okay. You're gonna do that? Okay. It protected itself. Why would you protect yourself? There's no escape from Noob Cybot. Here we go. Suck it. There we go. No more Pelipper right here. Pelipper defeated. Noob Cybot wins. And she's going to be coming out with her Skarmory. So it's only fitting that, you know, hey, this might be the last episode you'll see from Raiden for a while. Let's finish it off with Raiden, the main neck trick himself right here. Look at this guy. He's all bitchin' looking good right here. That's right, Skarmory, you don't scare me with your electric type attacks and all that stuff. So here we go, spark attack, hopefully for the win. And nearly defeats that Skarmory. And here it comes with his steel wing. You don't scare me. Look at that. Takes a nice chunk. Critical hit. Not that effective. But we're going to finish it off with a... Oh, wow. Never mind. She's going with her Hyper Potion. But, but, you know, that Hyper Potion she was going to use anyways. Here we go. Shockwave. For the win. Finish him. Oh, crud. This Pokemon will not die. Okay, Spark Attack again. Really? Yeah, she will not, this, she will not let Skarmory die. Alrighty, here we go. Spark attack for the win. Come on. Yeah, this Skarmory will not die. Spark attack. Finish him off. Fatality. Raiden wins. Look at that. And Noob Cybot gains his experience points for, for not doing anything. So there it is, guys. We defeated uh, Winona, the gym leader right here. She's like, never before have I seen a trainer command Pokemon with more grace than I. Of course, in recognition, uh, or in recognition of your prowess, I present you the gym badge. And we get a lot of money for that one right there. So there it is, guys. We get ourselves the feather badge, our sixth badge. That's awesome. Great. It's awesome. With the feather badge, all Pokemon up to level 70, even those received through trades, will obey your every command. You will also be able to use the HM move fly outside of battle. And this, this is a gift from me. And we get ourselves the TM-40, which I believe is Aerial Ace, right? Yes, it's the Aerial Ace. It's speed. No Pokemon should able uh, should be able to avoid it. And there it is. We get ourselves uh, her phone number again, just to battle her once or twice. Though I fell to you, I will remain devoted to bird Pokemon. Okay, alrighty, let's do this. You know, feeling a little heavier, you know, six badges and all. You know, everybody hating. That's right, keep on hating. What do you have to say? You did it! You achieved a liftoff! Wow, you gotta love the puns. You really do. You have to love you, you really have to love the puns right there. Alrighty guys, so that's six badges right there. And we're getting a phone call right here, and uh, this is Sky, and he's like, Hi Draven, it's me! Just as I thought you won at the Fortree Gym. 
You're strange. Perhaps you really are the trainer that I've been searching for. Remember, you have a fan in me. I'll be cheering, for, or I'll be cheering from the sidelines. Keep up the great work. All right. Okay. So we got a fan, a stalkery fan, or something like that. I don't even know. Anywho, guys. Like I said, this might be the last episode for Main Electric. I don't know. Who knows? I will probably see. You know, we shall see if he comes back eventually in, in another episode or so. I don't even know. He will. What, 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 what am I kidding, guys? Main Nectric will be back. It's just I kind of want to use uh, I kind of want to use a uh, new side for right now. So thank you guys for watching. Everybody say goodbye to Raiden for a while. Thank you for your help. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. See you guys. Thank you.